Coach, you've had some time to reflect on the Jackson State series. What are your thoughts about the overall outcome of the weekend? Well, of course, you got to be happy with, with the outcome, winning two out of three at home uh, against a good opponent. Um, we didn't play very well on Saturday, but we came out with one uh, one victory on Saturday, and, and of course yesterday we played really well. We played much better. We played we pitched much better than we did on Saturday, and uh, and our offense came alive and uh, scored 14 runs. and And uh, I was happy and, and pleased with the uh, with the effort from the guys. Talk about this power display we've been on: 14 homers all of last season, 13 so far in 2013. Well, just very happy with it, and that's one thing that we needed to improve on. You know, we talked about getting stronger. We talked about that's got to be a part of our game, and uh, and I think that uh, the coaches have done a good job uh, working with the hitters, and uh, and our strength and conditioning coach, uh, Coach Jordan, has done an amazing job with the uh, with the possession players, getting them stronger. Um, we told him in the off season that that's the type of team that we wanted to be, and he's really done a, a magnificent job with with our guys, with our position players, getting them stronger to be able to, you know, uh, put a little bit more power into their swing. Being able to score almost on any swing, what type of jolt is that, and what can it be for the offense going forward? Well, you know, I, I think that you're never out of a game if if you have that type of uh, that type of team and that type of power. Uh, you're, you're one swing away at times, and uh, and you're giving yourself opportunities to to come back from from deficits. Whereas, you know, it would take three or four hits to score one run. Sometimes it just takes a takes a swing of a bat. So, um, so we must continue to do that. We must continue to stay in the weight room and and work extremely hard. And and, and those guys to understand that, um, you know, offensively we gotta we gotta continue to do a good job. Six and three in conference play right now, stepping out of conference for the next two weeks. Talk about your thoughts on where we stand in standings right now. Well, of course, I mean, you, at this time of the year, you, you want to be near the top. Um, we're, not, we're not undefeated by any, by any means, but, uh, but I, I think we're heading in the right direction. We've got to clean up a few things that, that I've seen that we have not done well. And those will be addressed at practice. They will be addressed in some of the non-conference games that we play. And uh, we should be ready to go when we continue uh, to play conference play. Talk about Tuesday night's matchup at Auburn. Well, Auburn being an SEC team and one of the better teams in the nation, it will be a challenge for anybody that plays. They're coming off a weekend that they lost three games against Vanderbilt, but they were close. Uh, two of the three were close games, and and the uh, the one that was eight to one, they actually they were it was a two to nothing ball game in the uh, in the seventh inning. So we know that they have good pitching, they have good uh, good offense as well. So you know our guys will be ready, we'll be ready for the challenge, and. You know, we, we got to record 27 outs and we got to play well uh, that day to be able to come out on top.